Well, hi everybody. Thanks for joining us on this foggy and rainy night uh, across the area. And so now we have some showers and even some thunder showers lodged in these showers. Uh, at this point, no watches or warnings uh, have been announced. Uh, it does look like we could have some thunder showers through the nighttime tonight and some areas of dense fog as well. But as the night goes on, actually the density of the fog will ease up somewhat as the temperature continues to rise so that by the middle of the overnight and certainly by sunrise, the temperature will be in the 60s. And here's Tuesday at 9 a.m. See how we have a pretty good covering of rain right along and through here, I would expect, because we have a warm front moving up over us tonight and then a cold front dragging behind. I would expect that this cold front will be moving through, oh, tomorrow morning, mid-morning for those of you in Illinois to the mid-afternoon for those of us here in Indiana. And then maybe some lingering showers into the evening tomorrow night, but that rain will be ending. But that will be just in time for perhaps a few little snow showers or snow flurries to crop up as we get into Wednesday as we take a big temperature dive. So for tonight, uh, some scattered thunderstorms, areas of fog, 54 for the overnight low, and then We'll have some, especially through the morning to mid afternoon, some thunderstorms, a strong wind, really windy day, a high tomorrow of 64. And then that wind blows in some colder air, an overnight low of 32. Flurries will be possible tomorrow night into Wednesday with a high on Wednesday of 37 degrees. Little sunshine as we get toward the end of the week and gradually warm up. But with the warmer air comes the possibility of more rain on Saturday and Sunday.